Shalom to you both. How are you? Hello. Shalom. Hi. Hello, Boney. Bon uh, good to talk Bonnie. to you both. I just have to start this off by saying how much I miss Israel. And if I could get on a plane right now, uh, so depressed. This is the first time I haven't been able to go in years. So I can't wait to be, you know, be able to get back there. But for now, we have this wonderful series. And Sigal, let's start with you because this is just unlike any Israeli series I've ever seen before. Where did the idea come from? And uh, Kola Kavod for making women so strong in this movie, in this series, sorry. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yes, yes, we're strong. And we have flaws and we, um, it, you know, I think it's, the the first image was these two women on the train and I started exploring those women and, and it was important to me, I think, to show, uh, to, to kind of, I think it's, it's this woman dealing with a midlife crisis and wondering about her relevance and being afraid of, of maybe this is it. Yeah. or is the peak behind me is it ever is this it or, or are there going to be other things in the future and you know all these kind of things together that i wanted to talk about kind of found themselves found their way into the story after the after i had i had worked on the characters yeah. and it kind of just came to be yeah and then you have this great cast and i let i want to ask you because what a you know we've been seeing you on screen big screen small screen for so many years you're such a fantastic actress this had to have been quite a challenge psychologically a craziness what this woman goes through <laughs> <laughs> sorry but she has a tough time Genius. with it yeah it's true i mean she she starts in a very specific place a very low place in her life not that she doesn't have i mean normal people regular people might go she's crazy um yeah. and perhaps she is <laughs> but she starts in a very you know specific place and then she gradually goes into a whole other emotional space and 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 that journey is is massive it's a, it's a it's a um it's definitely a roller coaster Oh, absolutely. And it really makes you think. And I wanted to ask you about working with Lee because the, you know, the relationship between your character and Sophie, you don't know if she's crazy. You don't know, like, what, why is she so drawn to this young woman? I would have just smacked her across the face. <laughs> well, it's, you know, it's very interesting to see the reactions to certain women feel the same way as you do. Uh, some women are very attractive to what she represents and who she is. And, and I think deep, deep inside, she really evokes something within us. Um, that's her role, really. She's a, an evoker. Um, yes. she, she, because she's so extreme, you know, and, and she's so, you know, she has a very specific path. And at certain play, I mean, she, and obviously she's in her 20s, so she can afford it. Right. <laughs> I don't know how that looks in her in your 40s. You know, maybe it's not as charming, but um, but definitely Alice is extremely attractive to this quality because she I think she she used to have that quality. And I yeah. think she, it reminds her where she wanted to be or where she used to be. And and I and there's a creation creative force in that space that um, she has to be in order to create what she needs to create. So, uh, yeah. you know, so she she she, she needs her. Yeah, she absolutely. definitely needs her. Yeah. Oh, that's for sure. No, it's it's good to to watch it. But quickly, I um, Seagal, I want to ask you because here you have Islet playing a female director. What tips did you give her to play this role? <laughs> like personal oh, tips. I, I almost didn't have to give her. I mean, by by the time we reached the the part where she's directing the film, yeah, the you know Islet had so much time with me, and I I felt like she was. She was doing her research on me, so at some at some point it was, you know, I'm with 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 the headphones on my ear, and she's on the headphones on, on her ears, and she's looking into the monitor, and I'm looking into the monitor, looking at her, looking into the monitor, and it was just, it, it was there, there, it was too much at some point. It was almost like, okay, wait, who's who's who is is, and so 
Yeah. It, it, it was pretty trippy at a certain point, you know, because the whole thing is pretty deep and pretty, pretty dark. And so that was, that was funny. What was, the, the, what was the word you used uh -huh. when you, when we were chips. filming the filming? Chips. chips. So I used to, I had to scream cut, but yeah. Sigal was calling so I didn't chips. Wanna, so I didn't want to use cut because we needed we needed Ayala as Alice as the director to saying cut. So, so if I had to cut, I was yelling chips and <laughs> to get it all straight. Well, congratulations to the two of you. It's really a fantastic series. I can't wait for uh, for us to he watch it here in Canada. I can't say Thank enough you. about it. And uh, like I say, kola kavod. It's my pleasure to talk to you Thank both. You. And best to you. Stay Thank safe you. and stay healthy. Thank you so much. Yeah.